Mm. Disney, you dirty slut. Guys, okay, so just another day in the studio. I'm chilling out here. And what is this I see on my Twitter? Oh, Star Wars, The Clone Wars, reporting in for another tour. Clone, hashtag Clone Wars saved. Ooh, this is dirty. This is Lucasfilm, you're dirty. <sighs> okay, so if there was anything that could get me excited about Star Wars again, it was this. Like, the return of Clone Wars is one of the only reasons that I would even remotely be excited about Star Wars again. This, this right here. You guys, Clone Wars is back? <sighs> All right guys, come on. Let's watch this trailer together. So it says here, 14 minutes ago, it was uploaded. Let me get the lights off. My name's Rex, but you'll call me Captain or Sir. War does not come with a guarantee. No soldier gets the promise of safety. My designation is Trooper 27-5555, sir. We call him Fives. I'm Heavy. This is Echo. I'm Commander Cody, your new boss. So yes, sir! Looks like we got ourselves a batch of shinies, Commander. Look around. We are one of the same. Same heart, same blood. Your training is in your blood. And my blood's boiling for a fight. This is our home. I deal with this so much as horrible. This can't be good. We need to pull back. Get back on the bottles. If we can draw them out, we can see them. If we can see them, we can hit them. Ahsoka, Quinlan Voss. <sighs> dirty, this is dirty. Okay. The only conclusion that I come to is that mm -hmm. Disney basically saw what happened with Solo. The boycott was successful. And um, they're desperate at this point. They're just... Uh, you know, they're trying to find anything that fans like, that anything that fans connect with. And obviously the Clone Wars did really well and everyone loved the Clone Wars. So why not bring it back? And it was kind of left unfinished. And you know, that Clone Wars is the one thing, the one thing that they can do right now to bring excitement back to the franchise. And if, it, if this is directed by Dave Filoni, I don't know, let's come over here, let's see. 
I don't know if it says on the video, but um, let's see here. Nope, it doesn't say who it's directed by or anything, but I do want to point out, okay, this guy right here, that, that is Quinlan Voss. I'm pretty sure that's Quinlan Voss. And then we see Anakin with his longer hair and Captain Rex. All right, Rex. What's so important that you brought us all? We start to see more of the Imperial look for the Starfleet. All the way back here. Hello, Master. And there you have it. Ahsoka Tano. With her slightly more, uh, I guess, mature look. And she's kind of has the little headband or whatnot going. And she is apparently with some Mandalorians. Could this be Sabine Wren? I don't know. I don't know. But the old animation style is back. Um, Star Wars Rebels was... It was okay. But the animation style, I was never a big fan. To me, what made it that show work was the story. The story was pretty good. Now, this is, this is the good animation style that I like. And I'm telling you, if this is true, if the Clone Wars is back... Ooh, Disney, you're so dirty. I know your tricks, but they're working. <sighs> Look. I'm gonna watch... I'm gonna watch The Clone Wars when it comes out, okay? The new... The new episodes. I'm probably still gonna boycott episode 9, but we'll see. I don't know, but this is... This is pretty exciting. I, this... Look. Star Wars is like a dying fire inside of my heart. It's just like, it's barely there. It's like ash, you know? And with this news, it's kind of like, you know when you like blow on a fire and it like comes back to life? This is what's happening right now. Disney, Lucasfilm, you're, ah, uh, you're so dirty, but I love you for it. I love you for it. Good, this is, you know what? They listen to the fans for the first time. Disney finally listened to the fans for the first time. We've been asking for this show to come back for the longest time. And now we have it back. I don't know for how long. Uh, I know that... Um, I hope Dave Filoni directs it. I don't know too any detail. I literally just got the tweet on my phone. And so this is all... This is, um, this is crazy, but look, look at me. I'm excited. I, I've, I've criticized the recent Star Wars movies, uh, extensively, but this, this is exciting. Guys, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. I, I'm excited. Are you excited? I don't know when this comes out, but we'll see how good it is. Um, I'm going to get back to work. I was, uh, songwriting in here a little bit. Um, there's the guitar, and there's my drums. Um, I'm gonna get back to work, but man, I couldn't not do a quick little video. Like, this was super fast. I'm, this is all one take. I'm probably just gonna edit it super fast and put it together, but <sighs> this gets me excited. And, um, I don't know. I don't know. The feature's looking good because this is... Look, I took so much heat for boycotting this movie. I've had people saying you're an idiot. You know, I've had people saying the boycott's not gonna work. Uh, you're, it's pointless, it's useless. Well, guess what? We did it, guys, we did it. I did it, you did it, we all did it together. We boycotted the solo movie. It failed miserably in the box office. And now look what we have, we have the Clone Wars back. And it's my guess that Dave Filoni is gonna be in charge of this because he's the, the guy that created this with George Lucas. So this gets me excited. Star Wars, you have a sliver of hope. There is always a sliver of hope and you are capitalizing on it. This is listening to your fans. This is giving us what we want. Good, good job, Lucasfilm.